I got an unusual tractor. It's a white farm oak cub. They were only made in three months of 1950, January, February, and March. And the company did this uh, as a promotion. They said they painted uh, the farm oak cub, the uh, farm oak C, and the super A was the only ones that was painted white. They were sent out to dealers to attract attention, to hopefully increase their sales. Once the tractor was sold, it was required to be painted red. They couldn't sell it as long as it was white. When I started tearing the tractor down to have it repainted, the inside of the hood was white. And when I pulled the wheel off, the hub behind the wheel were white. So I knew that I had one of the original white tractors. They are worth more than the standard uh, red uh, farm oak cub. And when people found that out, they started painting the red ones white. But you can, that can be verified by the serial number, and this is one of the original white tractors. The tobacco farmers use them a lot where they do one row at a time. It also pulled a one bottom plow and a, approximately a four foot or five foot disc. This is a 60 cubic inch, which developed approximately 10 horsepower. We use approximately a gallon per hour under full load, like if you was mowing heavy grass with it. It's a three speed transmission and one reverse. That was probably the one weak point on the Farm Oak Cub. They could have used another gear or two in them. But overall, it was a very proper little tractor.